There's been so many cards in the mail, um, like to the school, because they don't have my personal address. And I mean, they're just coming from states far and wide. Um, you know, Montana and even Canada up north. I mean, there's people are just sending thank you notes. Uh, 20, 25 states would probably sent us something. So uh, it's coming from everywhere. It's just really nice. It's positive. You read it and it makes you happy to know that there are people out there that are watching, that care, and that want. They want to hear good stories. They like hearing good stories. They, they're very appreciative. So it, it's very uplifting to know that they took time out of their day. You know, we're just trying to get a routine back. So um, just staying busy, trying to stay normal. Um, and just kind of taking it as it goes, one day at a time. I mean, I'm just a part of it. So there's part of curiosity, part of it I feel like I'm obligated to go just because, I mean, I was a big factor in it. So, um, you know, just part of the experience. I didn't know if it would be a healing factor or just a learning factor, I don't know. So I just, I just went. Whenever somebody's going through something, you gotta feel for it regardless. So, um, you know, we're all people, we're all in this together. I visit her every week. Um, since she's been in the hospital, um, just being there moral support for her and for her family. Um, I've told them I'm on speed dial, so if they want to give me a call, I'll be down there as fast as I can. Um, but she's so, she's so incredible that she's, she's just powering through it and being awesome. I did on the last day of school after the kids were already gone. Um, so I went back to school so I could send them off and wave to them and stuff like that. And then once everybody was gone, I went back up there and checked it out. And it didn't bother me at all. Really? Yep. Okay. I went in there and looked around and just kind of is what it is. It is what it is. Yeah, wow. didn't, I mean, it's still my room. It's always fun. That's why I teach, see them smiling, goofing around, being happy. So it was the last day of school, so they're probably more happy to, about that than they were about seeing me. Um, but whenever you see them smile, it's, it's a good day. The Noblesville's already been great. They've already been a safe district. It's just a, a bad accident on a day. Um, unfortunately highlights it, but um, it was safe before, it'll be safe now, it's safe in the future. So they're just going to continue to evolve and get better like all school districts should.